Hi, it's me, Ellen. I want to show you how you can customize um, the template, the index template, the main blog page in a blog theme uh, super easily now with WordPress blog themes. It's pretty cool that we have now access to this page as users and we can sort of rearrange things, um, customize the excerpt length or even show the full post content or hide the date and instead so show only the categories or show the po post author or not. So it's really cool that we have access to these little details and I show you where you can find the templates and how you can customize it now in this uh, little tutorial. So the index page, the main blog page by default after installing the mock theme looks like that. So you have this little introduction text here and you have the date and title and excerpt, the author and the categories. And let's say um, you wanted to change this little text here or delete it altogether and change um, some of the content, maybe don't show the date, but instead um, feature the categories on the top. Um, I quickly show you how you can do that. And that's so cool with blog themes now that we can just go to the editor under appearance. And now we have this little navigation here and you can see uh, templates here. In the last video, I showed you the styles and it's really cool. I quickly just open them up because it's like the main feature of uh, the mock theme that we have all these styles and you can quickly give your theme a complete new look. Um, but I stay with the default now and yeah, you can um, access the, the main blog page um, via the templates here overview and it's the index page. You could also alternatively just click into the text, um, like into the content here and um, you would be able to edit the index page. But I just um, wanted to show you how you can edit templates. So it's this little icon here on the top and then the page opens up and for editing like more complex pages, it's always cool if you have the space to open the list view. So you can see this the header and footer here. And then um, if you click into the group blog or just click into any of the contents, you can see um, yeah what is going on here. So there's a header and a paragraph, a heading and a paragraph. And of course you wanted to change that um, first. So maybe you have a personal blog and uh, just want to Say hi, I'm Ellen. And then maybe something like welcome to my little personal blog. So you can do that or just completely delete that um, by just deleting this blog here. Or you can also do that in the little overview here. If um, this annoys you that you have it here, you can always change the settings and you use the distraction free mode um, or spotlight mode or the top toolbar mode um, to kind of change the mode here. Um, so you have the toolbars here at the top, but I'm just going to leave the default. So, um, so now you change this a title. You can ignore that because it's hidden and just the um, template, like the text in the template for if there's no blog post published. But let's say you wanted um, to delete the um, date here. So if I just click into any of the contents, I already see the blog that I'm editing. Um, you can just delete that, the date blog. And um, okay, you want the categories to go on top. You could either e either uh, move this up here, and um, or you can just drag and drop this in the list view on top. And um, I open the sidebar because um, I have a little bit of padding here on the top in the dimensions settings of the categories block. I see that. I don't need that if it's the first content but I want to add it to the bottom, which I can do here and um, just add the 12 pixels um, that I'm using throughout this layout. So that's um, I can do. I can also change the excerpt length um, just via the excerpt uh, block settings here, maybe just to, to 30 words. Um, I can do that. And yeah, I could even change the uh, layout here. I had someone ask me that and um, 
add another block and just add the complete post content. Um, post list, what's it called? Content? I think. Uh, probably post content. Oh, yeah, content. So this would be if you have like very short posts or maybe like Tumblr site blogging, um, you can change that and just show the entire blog post right away. Maybe you um, wanted to change the um, block spacing and the font size here a bit uh, to make it a little bit more dense. But um, if you have short posts, this is definitely an option. Someone asked me, so I'm going to show you that. Um, so you can um, definitely adapt it like that. So. Uh, you could also delete the author. Then I think something like we show in the demo here comes up. Um, you can save that and then you have a little reassurance um, like telling you what you're changing. So it's the index template. Um, you have to be aware that the archives are not um, changed. So if you wanted to change um, the layout on the archives too, you would need to edit the archives. Um, individual and then yeah like this you can change all the layouts uh, all the templates here of the theme just by editing them and in the next video I will show you how you can update and edit the single post template and what you definitely would want to edit there like right away um, yeah that's it and um, yeah just maybe look through the templates and see what you want to change if you haven't kind of worked with block themes a lot before, um, just show you uh, this is the mock theme I'm using in this uh, video. It's our latest block theme. And if you want to search for just block themes because you want to edit the, uh, the templates and want to have access to the editor, um, you can filter here. If you search for new themes, free themes, in the admin here, you can just filter with block themes and you have the latest block themes available, uh, which is yeah, just really cool that for a lot of uh, websites, um, just with the editor access and patterns, you can really build um, very fast and modern WordPress websites without needing any page builder and any additional plugin, which is so cool. And the sites are really fast. Um, the themes are really fast and just lightweight and have all this new possibilities. So it's really worth it to look into it. Uh, lots of things have happened for blog themes and the site editing experience. So it's really just an era, a new era that is beginning. And it's really exciting and cool to check it out and maybe yeah, start a new the um, blog with our mock theme. Um, I will actually do that for the new year. I have an idea for a personal blog and it, yeah, it was just fun to create the theme and really inspiring to do something totally different and yeah, just light and fast and, and kind of, yeah, not old school, in a, like old school and new in a way with a blog theme. It um, was really, really fun to do that. I hope you like the theme. If you um, like it and use it, please give us a rating on WordPress Org. That would be cool. And let me know in the comments of the video what you want to um, also like know or learn and um, yeah, how you like the, the content. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.